swords hanging above your bed? Your dad might be a psychopath. Are you in trouble? Do you need, need to get you out of here? I'm already kidnapping the princess. Hey everybody. Today I'm gonna check out some more Polymega. Today though, I want to try out a Chrono Trigger. Got a little description here. It's made by Squaresoft, and this was in a combo pack, the Final Fantasy Chronicles collection. Start a new game. Now this was kind of the dream team, you know, it had Akira Toriyama, it had great music, and so it has a lot of things about it that are really fun. Now this is the PlayStation version, which has some nice uh, featured videos. So I've heard that when they ported this to the 3DS or the DS, it's a little bit smoother, but I'm really curious to see how the Polymega can can handle this game. <laughs> it's launched, but not launched. Oh man, Mr. Toad is cool. That was really cool. I'm a big fan of fantasy where you have both prehistoric dinosaurs and robots. That's a fun juxtaposition. Roto Trigger. Alright. Well, they're... That's an interesting question, actually. I don't know how the Polymega does memory. I don't have memory slots. I'm gonna select this. Alright, it's acting as though I have a memory card, so that's a good sign, I guess. Let's do a new game. Okay, so we have active enemies will attack even if you are not ready, or wait, take your time and choose items and fight strategically. Let's go with active, just because that sounds different. A little more pressure. Alright, we'll just keep his name Chrono for now.
Chrono. Without the H, interestingly enough. Chrono. Good morning, Chrono. Come on, sleepyhead, get up. It's very Legend of Zelda. Ah, Leans Bell makes such beautiful music. You were so excited about the Millennial Fair, you didn't sleep well, did you? I want you to behave yourself today. Let's get moving now. Ah, I scared the kitty. Yeah, check out my room. Ah, oh, I love this sprite work. Can I interact with anything? Can't get behind my bed. How am I supposed to get to the bookshelf? Ah, it's fine. A little book here. Nothing? Nothing? Alright, let's get out of here. Finally. By the way, that inventor friend of yours... Was her name Bulma? Oh, you know. Oh dear, I've forgotten her name. I'm sure it's not going to be Bulma, but... Luca. Yeah, aka not Bulma. That's right, Luca. Don't forget, she invited you to see her new invention. Ooh. Run along now, and be back before dinner. Alright, I'm out of here. Let's go check out that invention. So, is that my house? My house is huge. Yeah. This whole thing is just my house. Not sure if this is Lean or Linné or how we're going to read it, but we'll just keep on... Ah, gosh, people coming. Hello, sir. Welcome to the Willio Fair. Have fun. Uh, hey. How you doing? I heard Luca and her dad have made another crazy invention. Hope it doesn't blow up like all the others. Aww. Have some faith. I'm sure it'll be great. This is Lean Square. They say people who hear Lean's bell will have interesting and happy lives. Well, I guess my mom's so good then. Who's this guy? Um, we're just selling stuff. I, um, I'm good. I'm good. All right. Who are you? Another merchant? Let's see. Bye. I could buy some of this, but I don't actually know what I need yet, so I'll hold on to my money. Those runners are busy racing, so they won't talk to you. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for letting me know. Press the X button while facing the bell, and judge your distance carefully. Press the O button. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna hit it. How about... here? Do I need to be further away or closer? I'm not sure. Yeah, that's what I want. I want to be as far away as I can from it then. Alright, let's try again. What? Rip off! Shenanigans! Shenanigans, I call. Shenanigans, I say. What? Okay, I don't know if I can win this, but not, not, I gotta try. I feel like I'm pressing it as far away as I possibly can. Nope, whatever. Whatever. Shenanigans! All shenanigans. This kingdom has been through a lot, like the war against Magus 400 years ago. Thank goodness things are peaceful now. Alright, yep, here's the runners. They won't talk to me. At least they're not running me over. Kitty. Hello, kitty. Goodbye, kitty. Can't anyone beat G.I. Jogger? Oh, do I have to race them? Alright, here we go. 
Let's start together. Ready? Are you guys ready? Go! I don't know the path, but how about I'm faster than you? Huh, what are you gonna say now? What are you gonna, are you gonna say now? I knew it! It's the Green Ambler! Wait, I just ran circles around all those guys. Ah, this whole place is rigged. Whatever. Who's this? This is the renowned Tent of Horrors. Spend your zero silver points here. Rental discretion advised. Well, um, if it costs nothing, sure, why not? Uh, floating head thing? Welcome to Nordstein Beckler's lab. The spine-tingling show is about to start. How many silver points would you like to pay? You said zero. I don't... Ten? You don't have enough points. Yeah, I know. The guy said zero outside. You must have been reading what my inventory had. Like, spend your gold, but I didn't have any... Whatever. Oh, that's a wall. Nope, not going that way. It's pretty funny. <laughs> when I'm at the wall and I press up, he's just like, mm-mm, mm-mm, can't go that way. Alright, well, let's keep moving. Who's this? What do you want? What's the big deal? So what if we won a war against a wizard hundreds of years ago? Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, wow. Ouch. Hey! Well, I was just trying to say hi. You dropped your necklace over there. Ouch, that hurt. I'm so sorry, are you okay? Uh oh, my pendant. Yeah, it's right there. Go go get go get it. It's right here. Here. Oh, thank goodness, my pendant. It has a lot of sentimental value. May I have it back? <laughs> I could say no. I'm not gonna do that. I came to see the festival. You live in this town, don't you? No, I live in a residence not too far away, though. I feel a little out of place here. Would you mind if I walked around with you for a while? Sure. You're a true gentleman. I mean, I'll... Sure. Okay. Oh, by the way, my name is, uh... Marley? Or Marl? I'm gonna say Marley. Makes me want to put a Y on the end of your name. Can I put a Y on the end of your name? I'm not sure. That's fine, I'll just leave it alone. But I'm gonna call you Marley. Uh, Marley, and your... Chrono, what a nice name. Pleased to meet you. Now, lead on. I'm getting some serious Princess Jasmine vibes here. Not just the outfit, but your whole personality. Like, you, you need an escort. You, you don't know how to, like, walk in town without running into people. Alright, sure. What do you got? Who's this? Yes, I know I have silver. Change 10 silver points for 50 gold. No, that's fine. Whatever. I don't want to be ripped off by your shenanigans festival. I hate fairs. Say, do you know the latest gossip? I'm gonna say no. Just between us, I heard the king is distressed over his tomboy of a daughter. Just once. I'd like to see how wild she really is. Lol. Well, I think I called that. They're still setting up. Why don't you come back in a while? Alright, so I guess I have to play something. Let's go check out who's over here. Wow, where's my cat? Oh, I saw a kitty. I saw him run around in the square. It's a soda guzzling contest. Press the X button as fast as you can. Oh, I can do that. <laughs> Let's do it. I don't know if it's working. Only zero cans. Uh, hold on, that's not what I wanted. You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Chrono? Well, I want it to actually work. We'll try again. Wait, is she drinking? I can't see what's happening. She's sitting in the same spot as I am and I can't move. Oh, here we go. Oh, she's using the analog stick. Well. Ready, set, go. 
drink, 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 yeah, only four, what? What do you mean only four? That's a lot. I don't know if I can do any more. Huh? I got five. I got six. Only six. I don't, I don't even know if I can win this. This is more crazy shenanigans. The whole festival. It's all shenanigans. All of it. Whoa. I do not know what I just stumbled onto. Pressing the O button and dashing here and there, I'm pooped. Catchy rhythm. Use triangle, square, L, and R1 to dance. Okay. Silly. Can I get to the other person? Lady da da What? Got some spending money from the elder. The kid's been dipping in the fruit punch again. Prehistoric dance. How enchanting. Can I get up there and dance with him? No? I can't I can't go dance? Oh, here we go. Alright, let's dance. Let's dance. Yeah, look at this. We're all dancing. What that's all about, but all right, let's get off stage. <laughs> Don't know what that was about. All right, let's find the little girl's kitty. I did see a kitty ring around. All right, come on, princess, let's find that kitty. Kitty, I saw you around here somewhere. Kitty, come here. How do I grab the kitty? How do I grab the kitty? How do I grab the kitty? Might not even be the right kitty, but uh, okay, fine. Do I need to bait for the kitty? No, just a second too late. Okay, yeah, well... I don't know what that menu is even talking about. Alright, don't press triangle. I'm kidding. No, kidding. Come with me. All right. Well, I can't interact with that kitty. Let's go. Maybe there's another kitty somewhere around here. Oh, well, that's cool. Let me check out the market. All right, princess. Just because you see some hungry kids, you don't give them food unless you can pay for it. What am I looking at? Visit our stall. What? What are you? I don't even know what that thing is. It's over here. Check out the boat. Uh, sure, where are we going? <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to be doing this right now, but it makes it funnier that I am. You know, kidnap a princess or two. I guess it's plausible deniability. She hasn't told me she's the princess. I didn't know she was a princess.
Now, if that little girl's kitty is over here, I, I have several questions. Hello? I take the ferry every chance I get. Okay, thanks. Nothing like a ferry ride. Alright, well, enjoy your ferry, kid. Can't seem to interact with... Oh. Snail? Okay, there's another one of those... What, what is this? What, what are you? I'm the Piano Man. Uh, play us a sad one, Joe, or play something upbeat, please. Sounds like fight music. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Alright, thanks for that. Everyone's over at the festival. What fools? 400 years ago, a woman named Fiona died trying to save the great forest that once flourished to the north. How sad. Some monsters coexist with humans, like that piano player. I've got the best jerky in town, but I'm saving it. I might let some of it go for, say, 9,900 gold. Uh, no. Didn't think so. That's an impressive amount of sound coming out of a piano. Alright, we have an inn, which we don't really need right now. Or... Mayor's Manor. The children are slipping away from us. It's so sad. person I hate most? My dad, of course. Oh, wow. He must be a teenager. Dad loves money more than he loves me. Oh, wow, you're like a little kid. Jeez, your dad, uh... You need to, you need to take better care of your kids, man. Uh, I run this town, and I'm so rich I don't know what to do with it all. Give you ten gold if you can act like a chicken. Sure. Haha, <laughs> here you go, 10 gold. Apparently that was acting like a chicken. Oh, there's another child. Everyone says Daddy's greedy. They're lying, right? I don't know, he just gave me 10 gold to act like a chicken. Sealed by a mysterious force. Okay. You have some ominous chest in your room there, little girl. Also, you have swords hanging above your bed? Your dad might be a psychopath. Is it- is- are you- are you in trouble? Do you need me to get you out of here? I'm already kidnapping the princess, so you just come with me. It's no big deal. Alright, well, I'll talk to everybody here. I wonder what else there is to explore. Land. What did that say? Oh. Zenon Bridge. Oh, okay, so I'm really not that far. I can walk back home. Lucas House. We have a lot of books just sitting on the floor. I'm just stepping all over them, too. Luca, where you at? Luca. Luca. No. Let's try left. No, lots of books, though. someone. Bora. Oh, hi, Chrono. Luca's off at Lean Square with her father, Tobin, unveiling her new invention. 
I wonder if they're behind the people who would let me pass, because I did not see Luca at the festival. Alright, let's stop wasting time. Let's go back to the festival. Oh wow, look at that castle. Is that your home, princess? I have to make it through the forest to get back to the castle. I wonder if we can. It'd be really funny if I show up at the castle with the princess with me. Oh god, look at that thing. Can I get past these things without running into them? Yeah, cool. I'm really curious what's gonna happen here. This should be fun. Who's there? Ah, uh, Marley's like, come on, let's check out the fair. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Disappointing. I mean, it, the game obviously had contingencies for that, so in case someone couldn't do exactly what I'm doing here, but that's funny. I really wanted to have a conversation like, Daughter, we've been looking for you. Where have you been? Alright, well, let's uh, check out these mushrooms. There it goes. Attack! I'm sure it's a Hitake, but I want to say Heat Take! Attack the Heat Take! <laughs> I don't know what he took, but Heat Take. We got it. Nine experience points. Look at us go. And three tech points. We found 48 gold. And a tonic. So that was kind of different. The a, action screen was the same as the overworld screen. Because I saw the, the monsters before we ran into them were on the world map, which is kind of nice, because Pokemon's been doing it forever where you don't see them until they're attacking you, so you can see them before the fight starts. is a little different. There's another chest. Steel sealed by a mysterious force. this side. An open field lies ahead. Yeah, with the mysterious force chest. So did the mushrooms respawn since I left the screen? Okay. There's a bird. Hello, bird. Can we interact with bird? Bird person, get down here. Yeah, I guess the fight has started. I, that was... I don't know what I had to touch the bell. Beetle and avian chaos. Oh no! Dingling! <laughs> Take that, you bird of madness! Got 10 experience points, 3 tech points, and some more gold. Also, I learned an attack. That's cool. Alright, I know the story wants me to stay at the festival, but until I can figure out how to interact with the cat, or find a different cat, I'm kind of stuck running around anyways. Attack the heat take! And I leveled up. And she leveled up. Okay, okay. For reals this time, let's go back to the festival.
does hit. These guys won't even talk to me when they're standing still. Nobody, 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 nope. Okay. I heard there's this guy pays big bucks for charms, weapons, pendants, and other rarities. Buy something? Uh, sure, what do you got? At least this merchant gave me the yes-no prompt before, just throwing me into his inventory screen. Buy, right, what do you got? Ooh. We have the Iron Blade or the Load Sword. This one increases my attack by... Two. This increases it by ten. But it's four thousand. I guess I might as well buy the one that I can use now. I live in the continent to the east. Come see me sometime. By the way, could you... Oh, okay, I was trying to figure out what the sentence was. Could you talk that young lady into selling her pendant? Uh, no, she doesn't want to sell it. But you seem disproportionately interested in it. Item. Iron blade. No, that's not what you want. Maybe I have to go to me. Me. It's wood sword for the iron blade. Very nice. We're killing monsters with a wooden stick. Look at that. Alright, well, I bought a thing. Anybody seen a kitty anywhere? Nope, nope, we already read this. Oh, okay, the device is all set up. I don't know if I just had to spend enough time or talk to enough people or, or what was the determined amount there, but alright, at least we can go find Luca now. Hold your horses, I want to get some candy. Did you, did you get your... Just give me a second. Okay, well... I must just know when you picked out your candy or not. Hi, I'd like some of this. Sure, young lady. Thanks for waiting. That was bizarre. I don't quite understand the pacing here, but... I am here for the ride. Step right up. Any of you who have the time and the courage, our Super Dimension Warp is the invention of the century. To use it, jump up here, and you'll be teleported here. It's the masterwork of my beautiful daughter, Luca. So this, this, is, this is how the time shenanigans are going to get started? Chrono, where have you been? No one wants to try the telepod. How about you? It looks like fun. I'll watch while you try it out. Just hop on to the left pod. Alright. Left pod, here we go. All systems on. Begin energy transfer. Alright, well. It looked like it worked. Wow, that was great. How was it? Want to try it again? It worked! I can't believe it! Oh, uh, what a thrilling display of science at its best, ladies and gentlemen. You're yeah, still with a lot of confidence there, Doc. What a kick! I want to try it too! Huh? Oh, Krona. How did you pick up a cutie like her? Eyebrows, eyebrows. Look at those glasses. Hang on, Krono. I'll be right there. Behold, ladies and gentlemen, as the vision of this loveliness steps aboard the machine. Don't go away, I'll be right back. You sure about this? There's still time to change your mind. No way, throw the switch. Okay, everyone, let's give her a great big hand when she reappears. All systems on. Begin energy transfer. The pendant's uh, causing to, to, to not work properly. Ah, what's happening? My pendant, it's... Huh?
Oh, good job. You ripped a hole in time and space. Good, good job. Luca, where is she? Show's over, folks. Let's let's head along now. What's going on, Luca? Where is she? The way she disappeared, it couldn't have been the telepod. That warp field seemed to be affected by her pendant. What are we going to do now? She's so familiar. I know I've seen her somewhere. Yeah, yeah, it was the princess. Good job, idiot. Chrono! You're actually going to do it? What a fine lad. Listen, I don't know where the machine is going to send you. We haven't any other choice. Won't they both be lost? This is our only hope. That pendant seems to be the key, so hang on to him, Chrono, and brace yourself. I was just trying to pick up the pendant, but apparently I've, I've automatically volunteered myself, which is fine. I know that's how the story's gonna work, but... Begin energy transfer! Power to full! Roger! More! Give me more power! Roger! There, we did it! Time for me to get chopped up in little pieces. Now somehow I held onto the pendant. I'll follow you after I know what went wrong. Good luck, Chrono! Well, without the pendant, that might be hard for you to replicate, but sure, good luck with that. Whoa, check me out! Doing the time warp! It's, it's all wibbly wobbly. Ah! Alright. I guess this is a pretty good stopping point, though. So. Oh, got some answers coming. Oh great, I have to fight these things. Alright, well, let me fight these things first, then we'll get to a good stopping point. Now I'm at a good stopping point. So again, guys, just trying out the uh, Polymega here and tried some Chrono Trigger from the original PlayStation release. i just kind of piecing out what I know about the story so far, and looks like we time-traveled, and the princess was sent back. we got to figure out where she is. If you enjoyed the game want to see more, let me know. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody.